Hey guys, Backyard Scientist here. Today I'm going to show you how to make a vortex cannon out of an old paint bucket in a garbage bag. It can shoot smoke, air, or fire, and for only $5 and 20 minutes, it is an awesome project. Come check it out. Now we need to cut two holes in the top of the paint bucket. One is for the garbage bag and the other is for the smoke to come out of. Once you drill the two holes, take your trash bag and put it over the top. Press the lid over the trash bag and make sure that you pull the ends tight so it's taut, just like a drum. Alright, now that we have our vortex cannon built, it's time to fill it up with smoke. If you have incense sticks, you can use that too. Now, try your hand at sharpshooting and try to shoot a ring through each other. Or, just shoot them through the air. Shoot some paper cups. Or, shoot them at your cat. The possibilities are endless. Now, some other things you can do are shoot them at candles and you can watch the ring fly by. Or, you can turn it into a game and see who can shoot out as many candles with one puff as possible. Either way, there's tons of things you can do with this. Alright, now it is question time. This is the part where my viewers send in questions for me to answer about my video. The first question is from Smarty Farty and he asks, What is a vortex? That's a good question. Our next question comes from viewer Blonde Sonic. She writes, This video sucks. You suck. A vortex cannon? Lame. I thought you did cool stuff. I do do cool things. This is the backyard scientist after all, and no video would be complete without me setting something on fire. Why do you think I have this can of propane? Why do you think I have this can of butane? You're about to find out. Not that, but in a second. Alright, all you need to do to turn this into a flaming ring shooter is a spray of butane in the opening. Just hold it down for a few seconds, turn off the lights, and you get these awesome flame rings. I'm going to make another video on this, and I'll go into further details about how it works, and including what can go wrong in this video, and how to prevent it. Like, don't get too close to the flame for starters. Check back next week for another video about this. Our final question comes from viewer Prince Ali. He asks, I'm always trying to find fun projects to do with my girlfriend. Do you think that she would enjoy this one? Why, yes I do. In fact, my girlfriend loves this project. She's always so surprised at how much fun it can be. XX Pro or Valencia? Surprise, bitch! Surprise, Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed watching my video. Don't forget to check back for more, and if you have any ideas for me, leave them down below in the comment section. And do I even need to say it? Come on, click the button.